is Jill Simonello with Pickup Truck Plus SUV Talk, and I am here with somebody very special who happens to be a great friend of mine. And uh, we're gonna get to know each other a lot better sometime soon because uh, we have a very special announcement to make, and that is the fact that we are going to compete in Rebel Rally together. So this is Kristen Shaw, and she is a freelance writer. You can find her stuff everywhere, um, a general rock star, but she also is a staff writer for The Drive. And uh, we are gonna be spending, what, 10 days together? Yes, unshowered, in, 10 unshowered days. Unshowered, 10 day dude wipes. Um, but uh, in, in this truck right here. And this is the, the Hyundai Santa Cruz. Okay, so maybe not this exact truck, but this truck. And uh, we're gonna be in the Hyundai Santa Cruz and we are going to be an all-wheel drive model with a 2.5 liter turbocharged engine. It's 281 horsepower and 311 pound-feet of torque. And uh, we're gonna take this off-road uh, and I, I think I think you need to give a little bit more about what the Rebel Rally is because I've only read about it, but she has actually been covering it for the past couple of years. So. Rebel Rally. It is really special. It's an all-female off-road competition. 1,500 miles through the desert, through some canyons, in the dunes. Without showers. Without Let's reiterate showers that part. for many days. But <laughs> what's really cool about this and what the founder, Emily Miller, told me, it's, it's not just about the competition itself, which is intense. Like, you can't use your GPS. It's all yeah, paper, so we pencil. We have to turn in our cell phones. Yeah. No electronics, it's all paper, latitude and longitude, figuring out where you are, picking up points as you go. So we're gonna be really digging deep into the math <laughs> and figuring out where we are and how to get to where we need to go next. And the, the founder told me it's not just about the competition itself, but like what women learn about themselves, how they learn their own strength, and we've all we already talked about you know how our yep. personalities mesh it's really right. important that you pick a partner who meshes well with you yeah so um our objective is to compete it's to do as well as we can and to not die basically i think i think that's the end of the story right no we would like to win nobody's but the, died the, yet the most important thing is to like have fun and and to enjoy each other's company and uh to to do something that's really cool and so this will be both of our first time competing even though um kristen has covered it previously and it, it's it's women only so um but but it's just because it's women only doesn't mean it's gonna be easy like she said no. we, we are gonna be pinpointing points on a map and i will say that neither of us are navigators so um we're we gonna have, have to learn we have a lot to learn and we're actually gonna ask you to follow our journey as we go because we're gonna have to be taking classes we're gonna have to do some training and um, I, I think it's gonna be a really interesting story to follow and I know I'm super excited about it I am so excited and I'm really grateful to Hyundai for them yes. putting their faith in us their investment into us mm -hmm. letting us borrow a car but also like really encouraging and supporting yeah. us this is Hyundai's first time supporting the Rebel Rally yeah. and I know they are as excited as we are to see what this thing can do I think it's got all the specs that we need mm -hmm. to do really well in the X-Cross class which is crossovers right so with this one will have all-wheel drive mm -hmm. but it'll be almost bone stock and they're probably yeah. gonna put some kind of skid plate underneath <laughs> but other than that it's got 8.6 inches of ground clearance which yeah. is two inches more than what the Kia Sorento PHEV had and they placed second and third last year yeah why not us why not us all right we are yeah we're so. gonna do this so we are literally going to see you down the road in a desert. So stay tuned to watch our story.